Advocates for the 9-11 community have donated thousands of meals to health care workers and thousands of masks to first responders. News 12's Michelle Ross has more on the deliveries that the two groups are making on a daily basis across the city. From Rikers Island to hospitals, police and fire stations in all five boroughs, even going over the river to Jersey City. What else can a law firm do that is meaningful? during this period of time. Barish McGarry represents over 15,000 members of the 9-11 community. And in partnership with the Feel Good Foundation, a nonprofit also advocating for 9-11 responders, they've created a lunch donation program. It came to our attention. Um, these people are working 12-hour shifts at a minimum. And many of the times, they're just eating their meals out of vending machines. To date, they've donated more than 1,200 lunches and dinners to almost 40 hospitals and nursing homes in the New York and New Jersey area. And by the way, as a nice little aside, we're giving business to the local restaurants. They've also donated 50,000 masks to every firehouse in New York City, as well as police officers at dozens of NYPD precincts, corrections officers, sanitation workers, and many more on the front line. When you have a health crisis like this, you have to put, you know, focus special attention on the community that needs it most. So we're so happy that we're able to give back. And they plan on continuing these donations until the pandemic is over. In the Bronx, Michelle Ross, News 12.